Where did PewDiePie's small Ruby play buttons go? When PewDiePie got his Ruby play button for 50 million subscribers, he was also given a few small versions of it as well. And he said that he was going to give these away to certain people. And he said that all in the video, but I haven't actually seen anything come from this. Nobody has shown that they have received these awards, not even a picture saying, yo, look, I got this from PewDiePie. No post, no nothing. So what happened to those miniature awards? Well, in this video, we're going to look into that. So subscribe for more YouTube play button videos like this. So when PewDiePie got his Ruby play button, his 50 million subscriber award, which is a custom award given when you reach that milestone, his was a red brofist, which is his channel logo. And so because it was red, he called it the Ruby play button. But when he got it, he also got eight small versions of the award. So you got the big award and then you got small brofists that are like this big. <laughs> And he got eight of those along with his big award. And in that video, he said that he was going to give seven of those small brofists out to some of his earliest fans because in YouTube studio, you could see who has been subscribed to you the longest. So his plan was to give it to the first few subscribers that he had, the first seven. And of course, as long as they are still active. So I think he actually said something like he was going to give it to the seven oldest active subscribers on his channel. YouTube has a way where you can see who's your love longest lasting subscribers that is still active seven of you bros i'm gonna send out to my oldest and most active subscribers because you guys made this possible and then the last one the eighth one he was going to give to someone else just a random fan a random subscriber that posted a nice comment on his channel i've got one more that i'll give away if you leave a comment and a message that i'll appreciate and like so that's all we heard from it what happened to those mini awards? Because none of these eight awards I have seen since that video. Did anyone get the awards? You know, did any of his earliest subscribers or that random fan, did they ever show that they got these mini brofists? Where did they end up? Well, I did some looking around on the internet and I found the answer and it's actually not as good as you would think. <laughs> In November, 2017, PewDiePie posted an episode of Lawai where someone posted like a jello looking brofist which reminded him of the mini awards that he got. And he said basically that he lost them. A cute little, it's like the Ruby bro fist that I promised that I would give out and I didn't lose, I did not lose them at all. I still have them very kept very safely and I still have them. So instead of giving them out to his earliest fans or the random fan, he accidentally lost the eight mini awards. The mini Ruby play button awards are missing. <laughs> he doesn't have them, but who has them? That's the part we don't know. I don't know it either. It would be cool to find where they ended up. You know, maybe it just got lost in the move because I know around that time he had to move offices, so he probably lost it then. And that's something we don't know. <laughs> so if you do know where they went, let me know in the comments below or tweet at me on my Twitter or something like that. Just let me know where they went. Maybe someone found the box full of them somewhere and decided to keep them for themselves. Or maybe someone had no idea what they were and threw them out, which I hope not. Or maybe someone actually has them and posted about it. We just don't know. So until then, there's no new information on it, but I just wanted to remind you that yeah, these secret YouTube awards exist. Now, another question I have from this is, did the other channels that got a Ruby play button, did they get small awards? For example, T-Series, or Conzilla. Those two got 50 million subscriber awards, but did they get mini versions of them? I don't know. When both channels, T-Series and Conzilla, were presented with it, there was no sign of mini awards, but of course they could have been given it backstage and we have no idea. And then there's Blackpink. They got an award around the time when they hit 50 million, but we don't know if this is an actual award, if that's what it's intended to be. It's actually an invitation award, but I don't know. Is it a 50 million award? I don't really know. They did get four of them. They got four of these awards, one for each person. So that's sort of similar to the eight that PewDiePie got, but he doesn't have eight people on his team. So where did, I don't know, it's weird. <laughs> the only other way we will know if any other channels with 50 million will get these is when Mr. Beast gets his. I wonder if his will come with smaller versions of his award. I know he got one from his friend. That's not an official award, but when YouTube sends him his, It'd be cool if they gave him the big one as well as eight mini small ones, just like PewDiePie got. And so yeah, that's it for me in this video. If you enjoyed and want to know more about this stuff, click that subscribe button so you will know whenever I post a video. And yeah, that's it for me. Thank you for watching. Fly on.